Smart tutorials. Make felt patches or pins. Materials. This is a sewing project, but it can also be done with glue. For those who don't like to sew, you'll be making three decorative patches that you can choose to turn into pins by adding pin backs. You'll need thick felt in white, yellow, and blue, thin felt in black, blue, red, and white, scissors, pin backs, needle and thread, in yellow, white, red, blue, and black. Step one, print out the patterns. You'll find the site on this slide and in the description box below. Step two, cut out the patch pieces. Use the patterns to cut out the patch pieces. Keep the pieces organized between the three different patches so they don't get mixed up. Note, be sure to use the thicker felt for the large circle. Also, each of the patterns includes two large circular pieces. The second circles aren't shown here. They'll be used only if you opt in to make a pin instead of a patch. Step three, sew the patches. For each patch, sew or glue the felt pieces onto the thicker felt circle. You may find it helpful to use straight pins to hold the pieces in place when you sew. You'll be sewing on the pieces in ordered layers from the bottom up as shown below. As you stack the pieces, you'll be sewing up through all the previous layers to create a quilted look. You can sew however you feel comfortable, but this is the stitch that I use. It's the same stitch on all of these, these patches. But So this is for the eye. So I've, I've pinned down the white part onto the red. These are the two I'm sewing together. I've come up from the back. So I just do this really small stitch around the edge. Really close, you go down. Like that, and then I come up really close. It's a tight little stitch. So it'll look like this all the way around the edge. Here is the heart patch. One, sew the heart shape onto the thick white circle. Two, sew the medium white circle onto the heart shape, and then continue from there. The rocket has all the steps shown on this slide. As noted in number three, you can let the yellow flame hang over a little. Here's the eye patch with all the steps as well. On four, there will be a highlight in the pupil. To make the highlight, using white thread, sew up through the center of the black pupil like sewing on a button. Make a few small, close stitches to create a white highlight. In five, you can see the outer eye hangs over the patch a bit. In six, you'll sew on the lashes. Using black thread, make one or two short stitches per lash to make the lines. Don't worry if the back is messy. Okay, so this is how you do the eyelashes. So I've already drawn on with a pencil all the lashes. And if you have trouble drawing, you can sort of use the edge of the pencil like this. It goes on better that way. Okay, so here's how you sew the lashes. Okay, you come up really close to the red edge with the black thread. So for this one at the end, it's a little shorter, so I'm just gonna do one stitch. And just go down. Just like that. For the longer ones, you can use two stitches. So you come up again. You don't need to worry about the back. The back can be messy. Let's go like there. And go up to the end. And just come down right at the end of that stitch. Like that. And then you just keep doing it until you get to the end. 
And like I said, it doesn't matter what the back looks like because it'll either be a patch that you sew down or if you make it a pin, you'll put a back on it. Okay. Step four, to make a patch into a pin. Cut out the second large circle from the thicker felt. This will be the reverse side of the pin. One, sew the pin back onto the felt circle as shown. Two, glue the circle to the back of the patch. Three, sew around the edge to complete the pin. Here are all the finished patches.